This video will show you how to create a magnetic wall using magnet paint available from firstformagnets.com. Here is what you will need. Magnet paint available in a variety of sizes up to a coverage of 10 square meters. At least three clean paint trays. Microfiber cleaning cloths. Three short pile rollers and roller, one for each layer. Fine sandpaper and masking tape. Step 1. Measure the area to make sure you have the required paint. Each tin is clearly labelled. Step 2. Prepare the surface. It is very important that any uneven or flaking paint is removed and the surface is sanded before painting to ensure the final painted surface is as smooth as possible. Once sanded, Use a clean, damp microfiber cloth to remove dust and grease. Step 3. Mask off all areas around the surface you are painting to avoid getting stray paint on joining walls, ceilings, skirtings and fixtures. Magnet paint must be applied with a roller, so you will have to roll it right up to the edges of your surface. A covering up cloth to protect floors and carpets. Step 4. Prepare the equipment and mix the paint. Magnet paint should be applied using a short pile roller that has had any loose fibres removed and a brand new tray to prevent any contamination of the paint. Open the tin carefully using a suitable pointed object such as a flat head screwdriver and mix thoroughly for several minutes to ensure all the iron particles are completely mixed in with the paint. Once fully mixed, the paint should be grey in colour. You should never mix magnet paint with any other type of paint. Step 5. Apply the paint. Ensure you apply plenty of paint to your roller and apply to the surface evenly and in straight vertical lines where possible, right up to the edge of the areas you wish to cover. You should avoid using brushes and overlapping the paint where possible. It is recommended that three coats are applied to give sufficient attraction. Once touch dry, Paint will have a weak traction after just one coat. Allow four hours for the first coat to dry before gently sanding to a smooth finish. Step 7. Apply the second coat. Again, apply in vertical strips, avoiding overlapping areas where possible. Once the second coat is applied, leave another four hours to dry. Step 8. Sand again. It is important to sand down after each coat to ensure the final surface is as smooth as possible. Step 9. Apply the third and final coat. Step 10. Once your third coat has been applied and your wall has been left a further four hours to dry, it is time to show off your new magnetic wall and plan your top coat. Of course, if you like the dark grey finish, you can leave it bare, or you can cover with a top coat of your choice of emulsion after 24 hours. Apply whiteboard paint or blackboard paint to create a truly interactive surface. Both are available from firstformagnets.com.